This is tutorial number 52 and it covers AVI animation within SOLIDWORKS. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create an animation of an exploded view being assembled. Now to start off let's open up the staircase which I've included on the DVD. Now once you have it open we have to open up the AVI animator so let's click tools, click add-ins, click SOLIDWORKS animator, click OK. And now you have the animation bar at the bottom, so let's click on that. And I've included an animation of what we're going to make already, so you can look at it and reference yourself to it. So if I go across, you can see the animation. And we're going to start out with just that, and we're going to end up fully assembled by the end. So to do this, I'm going to show you what we need to do and how to do it. So first let's go to the model and let's go to the configuration and we already have an exploded view of the model. So let's double click on it and you can see everything's exploded up and what we're going to do is slowly bring down every piece down to assemble it. So to start off how I made the other animation you have to have it in the exploded view mode. Now click animation and right click on it and click new so now we're creating a new animation. Now, just so all that we see is the parts coming together, we have to zoom in a bit. And now to create the collapse, and we can do rotation too, is by clicking the animation wizard. So let's click it, and let's click collapse. Click next, and we can say how long we want it to collapse for. So we'll make this one a little faster. Let's make it just 30 seconds. Click finish. And then we'll click the animation wizard to rotate the model. Click next. And we'll rotate it around the Y axis one time. Counterclockwise or clockwise. Click next. And we'll make it for the 30 seconds also. Click finish. And then that's it. So let's click file to see it. Let's zoom in, click play, and you can see the assembly of the model. And that concludes our tutorial on how to use the AVI animator within SOLIDWORKS.